Who's back? Your girl. She hasn't been here in a minute. By here, I mean you two. Where am I? You might be asking. I am at the Wallapai tribe in the Grand Canyon which is a reservation. We are here for the weekend. We're going whitewater rafting tomorrow morning. It's like a two day thing. So we're having dinner, sleeping here, waking up at the crack of dawn, hitting the adventures. We're going rafting and hiking. And then we're gonna post up, sleep on a beach. I'm here for work. I'm here for Huff Post. We're gonna write about it. So stay tuned for that. I thought I would bring y'all on this journey. Come with me to Arizona. I'll get some footage of the lodge. So this is like a reservation. So they offer all of these excursions here. I'm gonna do a little tobacco offering. I think I'm gonna do that now. So I feel like every time you go into a new land, you gotta show respect to that land and to its ancestors and everyone that came before. So I brought some tobacco with me. And I'm just gonna go outside, I think, and, and do a little offering and say a little prayer as we do. And I will show you around the lodge. And if you guys are ever in this area, you could stay here. They, ha they have cabins here, all sorts of different things. But yeah, stay tuned. But welcome to Arizona. <laughs> Okay, how nice. So they had a little welcome bag for us when we got here. I took all this stuff out. Look at this. A water, a Powerade, a nice water bottle. We know I need that because Lord knows I'd be losing mine all the time. A little tropical nut mix. It's like they knew I get motion sickness all the time. Some Motrin, a little Kind Bar hat on the historic Route 66, and then my own little dry bag. How nice. I also got some goodies from the souvenir shop. Let's have a look. We know we had to bust out the books. It, I honestly think I'm gonna go back for more books because there's more. This one is the Native American Tales and Legends. So this, I've re I know some of the stories that are in this already. And then here, the wisdom of the Native Americans. So we have some like some actual speeches of different chiefs and everything. And I thought that was amazing. They also have some like ghost stories told by Native Americans. So that's cool. I didn't buy it today because I'm, I'm, a, because I'm a baby and I'm gonna wait till my last day till I buy that and then give it a read. But yeah, tomorrow, big day. I'm super excited. I don't know if I will bring this camera on, on the rapids. We'll see. I mean, I do have two dry bags. I could put a dry bag inside of a dry bag and then put that dry bag inside of a dry bag. So maybe I will bring this camera and like bring us on some of the hikes. We'll see. We'll see. Morning. It is 7 a.m. right now and we are prepped and ready to go rafting on the river. Got my hair braided up, be camping the land on the side of the river. Tonight, it's cold today, so I got a nice insulated long sleeve, some pants on, spare set of clothes for tomorrow since it's gonna be really nice. I got my shorts, swimsuit, cause you know we gotta go in that river. <gasps> towel, that's what I need. Almost forgot my towel. Got my journal and some tobacco so I can offer to the earth while I do my little prayers while I'm out on the land. Yeah, let's go, let's get it. Let's see, I think I'm gonna actually bring this camera cause we have dry bags and I have faith that it's all gonna be good. We just did the craziest rapids. We smacked into a rock. Oh, this butterfly totally is flirting with me. I love it. We smacked into a rock. We did not tip. We got very wet. We had a great time. 
10 out of 10 would recommend. Oh my god, look. It like, keeps coming right at me. So What a gift! Sorry, I was trying to get it. I yeah, think I did. that's okay. My butterfly friend. What? Say hello to the butterfly. Oh. Hello, beautiful butterfly. Hi. that we just set up. Here we are, Tent City. Tell me, have you ever camped in the Grand Canyon? Hmm? It's unbelievable, look at this. Look at how nice this is, y'all. It's literally a dream come true. Gorgeous. Good morning. What a night. I actually slept pretty good. Throat's a little dry though from the desert. But overall, it was a good night. Look at this beautiful view. Like, can you imagine? You wake up on the Colorado River and this is the view. Like this is unbelievable. You literally cannot beat this experience. Incredible. What's up with the foam over there, China? The witch? Yeah. Oh, this, uh, it's a wind catcher. Oh. Okay. So it doesn't oh. obstruct. Well, that's it. That's all, folks. Thank you for making it to the end of this video. Thank you for coming with me to the Grand Canyon. Honestly, it was the most unique, amazing experience, maybe of my life. I think if you're gonna go to the Grand Canyon, you should absolutely do this. It's the Wallapai tribe. Hit them up, stay in the lodges. They have really, really cute accommodations. I mean, how many people can say? that they camped in the Grand Canyon on the side of the Colorado River and literally rafted the rapids. Like, I'm not gonna lie, it was wild, but it was so much fun. Like each rapid I went through, I was like loving it more and more and more. And the people that you meet and the conversations we had around the campfire, people from all different walks of life, from all over parts of the world, that is what life is about. That is what we live for. Hit them up, do the excursions. 
Live life, man. Do the things that scare you, okay? That's my little bit of tidbit for now. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. I love you all so much. Until next time.